this place. Good evening to all. Good evening. I'm here in the Warren's area again. I visited Massey Supermarket in the background and the government offices over here. Where the unemployment bureau is and so on. And this is Price Smart Barbados. Price Smart over here. And this is the Dome Mall, which has a branch of Burger King, Burger King restaurant. So this is the Massey Dome Mall, which is now up for sale, forty million dollars. So this was originally Warren's Motors when it was Galaxy Motors, which is the agent, which was the agents for. Mitsubishi vehicles in Barbados and this is Chicken Barn restaurant so this this is the dorm mall on it and this is the dorm mall itself which was once Massey dorm mall and then in 2002 the Costa Manning's appliance store moved into this building and then it was Warren's Motors in there as well So this is the dorm mall here, which is now owned by Massey. And there's a branch of First Caribbean Bank in there as well. And I'm looking towards the First Caribbean Bank headquarters at the former Michael Mansard building. So that's guys. Massey Door Mall, which was built here in 1999 as a farmer. Um, that was replacement for a Fort Royal garage, which was in town. That was the agents for Mitsubishi vehicles in Barbados. This is the roundabout now. Everton Weeks roundabout, no. This is situated at Warren's. At one of the busiest commercial areas in Barbados, outside of Bridgetown. This roundabout was named after one of our cricketers, the Everton Weeks. Famous West Indian cricketer, the three W's, Worrell, Wall, Cut and Weeks. And I think they're all buried at the University of the West Indies at Cato Campus. Good evening. That's where the Everton Weeks roundabout. Warren. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So yes guys, this is the Warren's business and commercial area that I'm in, which is known as a city away from the city. Our businesses started town into the area. The Warren area started to develop sometime in the late 90s. When businesses started moving out of town into the area. Uh, it is also a part of the ABC highway. <laughs> The main highway which runs from the Grali Adams Airport, the Grali Adams International Airport in Christchurch, which is to the south, the University of the West Indies, Carefield Campus, which is to the west. The ABC Highway was the plan of Tom Adams, who was Barbados' second Prime Minister, who wanted the highway to be built for more of us to have easy access across the island, instead of having to go the long haul route, 
but sadly Tom Adams did not live to see the completion of the highway. Tom Adams died four years before the highway was completed. Tom Adams died in 1985 and the highway was completed by 1989. The highway started to build in the mid-80s early to mid 80s yes guys the abc stands for adams barrow and cummings adams is tom adams who was the inventor of the highway and also barbados is like a prime minister and cummings is hugh gordon cummings i mean b is for barrow who was Aaron barrow Barbados' first Prime Minister, father of independence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A national hero. And coming to Sue Gordon Cummings, who was a member of parliament for St. Thomas. And he was also a doctor. And the hospital in Rock Hall, St. Thomas, is also named after him. So yes guys, uh, Hugh Gordon Cummings died long before, yeah, yeah, Hugh Gordon Cummings died long before the plan for the ABC Highway was conceived, Hugh Gordon Cummings died in 1970s. This is the first Caribbean Bank headquarters. Yeah, 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 Christopher. Yeah. This is the first Caribbean Bank headquarters at the former Michael Mansour building, which was once Warren's Great House. So, again, Warren's was once an agricultural area, an area mainly used for agriculture. All here used to be Cairn Ground, and there was no roundabout. And this road here to the left. Was no, was not always a road either. It was bare rocks, only rocks. Until the highway, until Tom Adams decided to cut the provision for the highway. So most of the parts, the roads that the ABC highway ran on was made to road. There was not always a road. The only road I had was the road straight ahead here, but the bank leading to St. Thomas, and this road to the left that leads to the west and north or west of the island. You can see this, the um, the Giselle had an office over here at the Williams Tower over here. Yes, there is Tom Adams had a vision for the Warrens area and Carl Williams as well. But the way the first business, yeah, 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 the first business to move in the Warrens area was structural system back in the 1970s, and that was long before Warrens was a business hub. I think Warrens was still a agricultural area of Kian Ground and no light running and just a narrow road with no on the boat just the road straight ahead to lead you back to St. Thomas or this road to the left to lead you back to the north or west of the island then the roundabouts came after the ABC highway started to build then they built a roundabout So all along the ABC Highway, you can find roundabouts now, along the way. Uh, 
just because Tom Adams had a visionary. Now the ABC Highway was his visionary. And this building over here was the it was intended to be a crematorium, but the late Prime Minister Arabara said it was too close to the road, so he decided to convert it into a polyclinic. So now it is the Warren's polyclinic. Now we name the Eunice Gibson polyclinic. So Warren is now a business hub. <coughs> a hub for business in Barbados. And the lights are around the boat should be soon coming on in about two minutes from now. Because that is a tradition every year at Christmas time. Where we decorate our around the boats with lights at them. Especially the ones on the ABC Highway. We decorate our around the boats with lights. Starting from November, which is our Independence Month, all through um, all through to December, which is Christmas, and then we take them down at the beginning of January. So for Independence, it will be yellow and blue, and for in for Christmas, it will be green and red. So this will lead back to the Warren's Industrial Estate, back to Wanakari Plaza, and back to Jackson, and back into the parish of St. Thomas, which is in the center of the island. The road to the right will take you back to yeah, the ABC Highway, to the south and in the east of the island, with the Bell, the Norman Nurse, Roundabout, Highgate Hall, and back up to the Buster Statue. And back up to Coy Church and back up to the airport. And this road here will lead you back to Bridgetown. And back to Coy Smart, Green Hill, and Warren. Yeah, 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 yeah.
for you this road to get to Ice to get to the parish of St. Thomas in the center of the island. The Parasens Cave and that area. Thank you guys for watching now and have a blessed day.